In this video I'm going to show you how to f convert between rectangular and polar form on the TI-30X Pro calculator. So to do this we'll just jump straight into an example. So we're going to convert 3, 4, so 3 along that way and 4 up that way defining a point into polar form. So we're going to define this point instead of by looking at x and y you have some distance r rotated through theta and that defines the point. So to do this, what we have to do is enter this r to p uh, function, and this r is telling you this r here, then we put in 3, 4, and that will give us the r value, so this length here, and then the r to p theta, which will give us this theta here when it has this um, argument or this data inputted into it. So what we need to do is we need to go to math, and from here everything becomes really simple. So if we go for math and go along to the R to P unsurprisingly, and if you go to number 3, you just press 3 or press enter on there, you get that function there. And then we just enter 3, and then if we press second function, and right down on the dot at the bottom, you get this comma, then 4, then close the brackets, and then press enter, and we get 5. Then we enter this, so you go back into math, go along, go down to number 4, or just press 4, um, and then put in 3, then second function, the comma down the dot, and then enter. So just input that, and that gives you the answer. So we get 5, and then 53.1 degrees, and that is the correct answer. And of course it works uh, in reverse, so um, say you go to just clear this, so you go math, and then go across, and we can get polar or rectangular. So we enter that, and then you put in r theta, so 5, second function 53.1, and that will give you 3, which is exactly what we expect. This is giving you the x, and then you do the same thing for y, and you can go backwards. So that's how you do these very basic conversions. Hopefully, this is helpful to you. and. Thank you for watching.